I started off, I've lived in Toronto most of my life. <clears throat> and uh, during the 60s, um, um, I was, uh, I played in a lot of different uh, electric, electric groups, uh, mostly R&B and pop. You know, and uh, in the 60s, um, I had a group in Toronto called the Big Town Boys. We had a TV show, a network TV show eventually, and, you know, we made records. And it was more of a local thing, or a Canadian local thing. And um, after that, um, after that, I, I, I actually lived in India for a couple of years. It was late 60s, and uh, which was quite an experience. And, um, and and that was uh, really broadened my musical uh, horizon, as it were, you know, and really got me thinking and into a uh, different kind of music. Because when we're, when we grew up in North America, I mean, especially back then, I mean, you only know the music you hear on the radio, you know, and uh, it's a pretty narrow perspective when you think of all the music around the world that's going on, you know. And, uh, and so anyway, that uh, really got me more into that kind of music. And I mean, since then, I've just been listening and, and trying to experience, you know, music from different cultures and, and this kind of thing. So I, I just did a project actually in Southern Colombia, which is just across the border from Ecuador with some incredible musicians. Really, really good. It's uh, I don't know, I would call it modern Andean kind of music. It's some of it borders on jazz, you know, pan flutes, charangos. These guys are really good. And uh, <clears throat> so I, I, um, I just recorded them in uh, February, actually. And I'm uh, actually, before I came to this very interview, I was mixing uh, the project, yeah, or part of the project, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So um, I'm, I'm. There's a, a much more to do in uh, Ecuador for me, and uh, and uh, yeah. the, the music down there is so rich. Ecuador, Peru, Chile. There's some incredible groups in Chile. I mean, really, really, really good. And um, so I, I, you know, I've got a lot of work to do there. Which uh, I love the music. It's just great. 